social vouchers is really a tool used to implement specific uh, social welfare policies. And even more and more economic policies such as green transition uh, with the eco voucher in Belgium. Cochec a été lancé par les partenaires sociaux au niveau interprofessionnel en Belgique en 2008. L'idée, c'était de lier la consommation écologique avec un objectif d'augmenter le pouvoir d'achat. Les partenaires sociaux ont euh, adopté une liste, une liste exhaustive, qui euh, fait une sorte de nomenclature des produits et des services qui sont éligibles. Cette liste est euh, bien sûr évaluée et elle est adaptée tous les deux ans. Le montant qui a été fixé par an, donc c'est 250 euros par travailleur par an. Il y a des arrêtés d'exécution par le gouvernement, la demande des partenaires sociaux, qui ont des conditions pour des exonérations en matière fiscale et parafiscale. Today in Belgium, half of the employees benefit from eco vouchers. Their increased purchasing power had a direct impact on retail and related employment with over 3,000 job creations in a year. Eco-vouchers are an efficient tool to raise awareness among consumers of the need to opt for ecological products and services. Study suggested that consumers do in fact worry about environmental problems and agree that we should lower our ecological footprint. They indicate to strongly take into account product price when making a certain purchase decision. And at the same time, they reveal a very positive attitude towards the eco-voucher system in Belgium. So we basically concluded that the system of eco-vouchers can affect steer consumers towards uh, more ecological, environmental, friendly consumption. One euro of eco-voucher spent saved one kilo of CO2 in 2018. Eco-vouchers trigger a saving of 230,000 tons of CO2 in 2018, so it's pretty significant. In March 2021, we adapted the list, we modified the list, and we took into account the new European Union energy label. At SVIA, we believe that governments should consider launching eco-voucher programs to support citizens' purchasing power and boost the economic recovery post-COVID-19. A forward-looking perspective in line with the ecological transition goals. I have to say that the eco voucher is gaining a lot of momentum and a lot of countries are looking into the Belgian experience to replicate this experience in their country. So as we know, the European Green Deal sets out a comprehensive strategy to transform the EU into a fair and prosperous society. So both green and just. And it's this social link to the green factors which is perhaps relatively new and which we see influencing our thinking on sustainable consumption and hence on vouchers as well. I think what strikes me is there's a whole range of good examples. Eco vouchers is one of them. Let's see how we can build one. So uh, it's still a, a story to build, uh, a story to tell and uh, to think of. <laughs>